Live from the 409, Ashley Elam and Mike Canizales, 409 Sports Blitz on 12 News. Brought to you by FordPlayerOfTheWeek.com. Hi, and welcome to another exciting Friday night. It is the 409 Sports Place. We are here in PAT, Port Arthur, Texas. That's land of the trill, bro. That's land right. Land of the trill. Memorial Stadium, Bun B. We looked for him. He wasn't here tonight, yeah, he though. Won. He wasn't. But you know who wasn't here tonight also? Who's that? The Port Arthur Memorial offense. Woo, hey, you went there. I didn't take it there, guys. I'm not being he mean, but there. maybe that was more to do with the Beaumont United defense. Yes. It's Port Arthur Memorial. It's Beaumont United. It's the game of the week. The Game of the Week, brought to you by Acadian Ambulance. And we are in Port Arthur, the Titans' first home game of the year. They have been on the road and in, in taking care of business at least one of the weeks. In the Houston area, pick this up. Yeah, check that out. Zemaya Vaughn, his pass is tipped, but James Wilson making a grab. Feed the man. That's a running back. They're on the move. That drive would stall. Later on, the drive would not stall, though. Wilson takes it in, punches it in for the score. It's 7 nothing. Beaumont United as the soul of the South plays on. Under two minutes left in the first. Jamar Sanders is busting loose, and there goes that man. Nobody's going to stop him. Cue up the band. Get the flames going. PA is on the board. It's 7-6 to six at this point. Now Vaughn trying to drive it in. Uh-oh, we got ourselves a fumble. Titans all over it, and it's going the other way, but they just couldn't get anything going offensively. Beaumont United D playing tough. Vaughn and the boys with the ball, swinging it out to who else? Mr. Wilson! Nice move on the outside. He's making a cut, nearly going to take it to the house, and he's just frustrated he didn't get in. Down inside the one-yard line, and then, you know what? He does the work. Vaughn gets the glory. That's what QBs do, right? This quarterback sneak, it's in. 14-6. to six. Timberwolves on top as we go to the final. It is all BU. They are 3-0. and oh. Your final... 35 to 6. I wasn't expecting that. Ash. Look, I look, both of these offenses came in hot. However, we knew United's defense was it was the real deal. You were the one who kept saying it over and over. Look at that D. Look at that D. They only put up, you know, both squads 16 points, St. Pius, everybody else, but I'm shocked. I gotta be honest right now. Titan Tibble, I did not expect that. I expected that offense to at least put up 21 points, not and, six. Right, and you know, you gotta look at it. The second half is where things really got blown open. It was 14 to 6 at halftime, and they were kind of you know, kind of just slugging it out, moving back yeah. to the middle of the field. Second half, a pick six really lit things up for BU, and they went on from there. But, hey, this was only one of the big games here in the South Mid-County area. They were all over tonight. Yes, it was. Hey, Ash, I'll tell you what, if I would have told you at the beginning of the season that Sillsby and Nederland